What's up, Survivor Fanatics? Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KJ48, and welcome back to Subsistence. All right, I've got a little list here of things I would like to accomplish over the next few videos in the near future, all right? And that would be, I want to get a roof on this thing and expand the base, okay? I also want to set up ladders. Uh, I forget what they're called. They're like um, hatch ladders? Yeah, ladder hatch. Uh, I'd like to get ladder hatches here going all the way down. Um, the problem is I think once I get a ladder hatch, I can't bring stuff up and down. Like what I want to do is I'm going to take all the foundations up here, every single one of them, and I'm going to bring them down and make a, another floor down here. I don't know if I can bring foundations down like that. I guess I could just drop into the water and might be able to do it. Um, I'm not really sure. But when I, when I do get the ladder hatches, uh, I'm going to put them right here in the meantime and leave this here just in case it's something i need also i would like two more plant beds um we've really got to start growing the plants a lot quicker than we've been doing uh and two more plant beds would definitely help out with that also i'd like a wind turbine so that's all the stuff i'd like to do over the next bunch of videos i don't know what i'm gonna get done today let's get out and do some farming i have done some farming off camera also my drill has been um well drilling let's take a look at it all right so we did get two pieces of copper already, which is awesome. And that thing's drilling. We've got a decent amount of power. And also the mining laser has been going, um, not the whole night, but some of the night. So we're getting, we're getting some work done. We've got a good amount of power. And I was told, I was told that once you get, once you get two of the solar or three solar panels done, you do a wind turbine. Right? You do a wind turbine every three solar panels. That's what I was told. So that's what I will be doing. All right, let's get out and get some stuff done today. Uh, you know what's really killing me more than anything, as far as the building goes? Um, I've got a decent amount of nails. The wood's looking really good. It's honestly the, the cordage that's been the problem for me. Someone asked in the comment section, why don't you why don't you ever make the bricks um, for the fuel? And um, it's a pretty interesting thought. You can make fuel bricks. Now, I've got two problems with the fuel bricks. First of all, I need the cordage. Plain and simple. Can't be wasted on fuel bricks. Second of all, this fuel brick fills up the the furnace and you really have to wait until the last minute to put it in there or else you're wasting fuel i kind of wish the fuel brick cost half as much like i wish it cost five plant fiber and only filled up half of the wood burner that would have been a lot easier to deal with because i've used the fuel bricks before but you really have to keep an eye on this thing like if if my fuel's right here i couldn't put a fuel brick in there because i'd be wasting a decent amount of fuel right there you know but I can't also go out because it's going to be empty soon. And I, I don't let my wood burner run out. So I'm not a big fan of the fuel bricks like at all. All right. So what we're looking for most out here today is uh, is freaking cordage or, you know, plant fibers, which is going to be awesome because it's the one thing I probably missed the most. The people are like, Cage, you missed 47 plant fibers today. And then I'm like, ah, oh, uh, well, hell. Uh, so also I'm looking for a lot of nails. Um, what is the easiest thing to get? Because I can just go out my door and get wood. It's also the most boring, unrecordable thing to get. But it's also the easiest thing to get. I've actually got an... I think I've got enough wood right now to actually build out the ceiling already. I think I did the math. I'm pretty sure I have enough wood. And I'm about 30 nails short. And, like, a lot of cordage. I only got about half the cordage. Um, which is a problem. So... Uh, oh, another problem I have is I didn't look for rogue hunters during the night. Damn it. That was a mistake. Always look for rogue hunters during the night. Uh, that, that could cost me. I'm going to kind of have to see. Hopefully, um, there wasn't any rogue hunters yesterday anywhere, so hopefully they have not moved in. All right. I do want to look for bags as well, as many bags as I can get. And my crops should be done pretty soon. Um, if not today, then tomorrow, which is good. Um, the crops are looking really good. The thing is, I've got to, um, I've got to find potato seeds because... I'm kind of thinking like pretty, not pretty soon, but I'm thinking like at some point in the near future, <laughs> the, the, the somewhat near future, I would like to attack the, I would like to attack the hunter bases. Now, when you attack the hunter bases, you go in and you'll shoot like three hunters usually, and then you got to get in their base because their door is locked, right? Let's say you come in, you shoot them all and the door is locked. Um, the best way to unlock the door is with Molotovs and the, and the only way to make Molotovs is with da, 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 potatoes use the potatoes to make the booze use the booze to make the maltovs now there's other ways you can break in but the maltovs are like really by far the best way uh i could sit there with a pickaxe and beat on the wall for 20 minutes or the the the, the door I really, i'm not gonna do that i'm not gonna do that i'm not attacking them unless i have maltovs uh so 
I do need to get some potatoes growing because you know, making the this this what is it called the still? I think that's the thing that makes the boost. Sounds about right. Uh, making the still isn't really going to do you much good if you don't have the potatoes. Uh, so and we also need to make glass, uh, which we have a decent amount of glass already. So um, that's going to be great. I'd also like to make the the oven, but that's going on the back burner. <laughs> no, no pun intended, exactly. Uh, the oven's going on the back burner just because um, it takes a lot of uh, of those, I forget what they're called, the, like those metal ingots or whatever. You know, the ones that you need the copper to make. Yeah, so uh, that's just not something that is going to be of utmost importance right now. Please don't walk my way. Yeah. Eh, get out of here. Get out of here. Hey, I'm looting here. Oh, great. What a piece of crap loot potato that was, too. <laughs> That's all right. We got it. Yep, he's looking He's looking my way, but he's not coming this way, so that's good. Oh, boy. There's a lot of loot chests over here. Damn it. Arg! Oh, my God. There's, like, three freaking animals over there. All right, forget it. <laughs> I know I know when, I've, uh, when I'm not wanted. Let's, let's head this way. Oh, F me. I just rolled up on a bear. I didn't think it was a bear. Oh, man. Oof. He yelled at me twice and, like, started, like, coming at me. I thought he was running at me, but... Oh, man. Freaking heart attack. I was trying to get some, uh, some plant fiber, and I was, I was rolling up on him. He only had, like, 180 hit points, and I was like... And I, I he kind of sounded like a boar. So I'm like, I think that's a boar. And then he just picked up his head. And it was a grizzly, too. Thank God it was a level one. I guess it doesn't matter. He didn't he didn't come after me. But, man, that was, um, oof. That was scary AF. How am I doing on the cordage? Oh, my God. I'm barely getting any cordage. I know I'm probably missing a lot. It's, it's hard, man, because, like, you're freaking super paranoid. You're like, oh, man, there's, like, everything out here wants to rip my head off. Uh, and, you know, it's just, it's it's freaking scary, man. And, of course, I didn't, like, look at night for the rogue hunter, so I have no idea where they are. If there's any even out here. Um, there are a lot of animals, though. See, if I come down in here, I could get, like, kind of trapped. And if I roll up on some hunters, it could be very bad for me. Hunters won't stop chasing you. And they're really good shots. They're stupidly good shots when they're moving. Like, they'll hit you constantly. Um, and it's a long run back to my base, so this is—I don't feel comfortable in this area at all. But um, yeah, well, let's see if we can find some more. Uh, what is that? Oh, it's a rabbit. Okay, I'll take the rabbit. Hold on. There we go. I actually caught a chicken too earlier, so I should probably bring these two back. And honestly, the reason I want to go back isn't so much because of these two. Um, it's more that, uh, before I left in the morning, I didn't check the fish traps. So, and if you leave the fish traps for too long, you're going to come back and there's not going to be fish in there. There's going to be, um, dead fish. Well, there's going to be rotten meat, which is what you're going to get. Uh, so I, re I really should head back. Um, I don't like going this way. Yeah, this is no good. Because you see, I'm going to run into this camp right here. So I should definitely head on over to the right and kind of like hug the right side to stay away from the... Hunter camps. I keep on calling bandits. They're not called bandits in this game. They're called hunters. Does it matter? Not really. But I'm trying to call them by their, you know, by the by the the name Da Dev. No, not Da Dev. That wrong game. Cold games. I'm trying to call them the name that cold games have given them. Oh, here we go. That's what I was looking for. I knew I saw one over here. I just couldn't find it. Uh, that's the same freaking bear. That's the same. Mother effing bear. Alright, so we're going to go all the way to the left over here. And just kind of head towards the fence. I didn't even see him. Did you guys see him on the screen? A lot of times, like, you guys will see him and I won't. It's a lot easier to scan a screen when you're not playing. So, uh, you, you guys don't understand where my eyes are. And this is a big screen. I can't see everything on it. Okay, so are we looking good now? Yeah. Alright, this is where I'm gonna have. I'm just gonna head around here, stay to the right, and then cut over to the left. Alright, this deer's asking for it. I think I'm gonna have to give it to him. I am so bad with the bow, though. I, I really wanna get a headshot. Nope, no headshot. Alright, well, let's see if we can finish him. 
it's, it's tough, and these guys really run. Oh, uh, he didn't really run as far as I thought he was going to. Come on, pick your head up. Nope. No headshot again. I'm going to try and get him. He's going to have antlers, which I, I kind of need. Shit, where'd he go? Oh, there he is. Uh... Really? Okay. If you say so. I'm out of hell with it. I'm not gonna look for that. I'm not gonna look for that arrow. I wanna kill this guy. Damn, man! <laughs> How many hit points does this guy have? I know that none of them have been headshots, but shit. <laughs> Little Johnny lives a lot here. Alright, where did he go? Where did he go? He in the woods. I'm not seeing him. Hopefully he went to the left. Because there's a wolf over to the right. Okay, I'm still not seeing him. Did he go a lot farther this time? Shit. Damn, bro, where'd you go? Killing me. Alright, I've been walking around looting stuff. It's been a while. I don't know what his hit points are at, but let's try this again. Oh, wow. I am just not good with the bow. I'm not sure if I'm aiming high or low. I really am not, just don't know. <laughs> that rhymes. I can kill rabbits, but that's about it. Okay, we'll grab that. We'll grab that. And there he goes again. Alright, there's a bear over here somewhere, but I'm hoping he's kind of over, you know, out of the way. I'm going to ignore that chicken. And let's come on over here, try and get some high ground. Damn it! Alright, come on, dude. <laughs> this is probably how hard it is to hunt, like, these guys in real life, I'd imagine. At least with a bow that you made yourself. Alright, so is that high or low? I can't tell. Nope, well, that seemed pretty good. But I only have one arrow left, so... This, eh, this has not been worth it, but I'm kind of like, I want to see if I can get him now. Dude. Dude, how many times have I, like, <laughs> that's like five hits on him. I mean, he did get some hit points back because it was taking a while, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try and hit him with this. There he goes. Yeah, I don't know, man. Like, he was getting some hit points back because, like, if you take too long, they do get their hit points back. So that that's that was my problem. But uh, five arrows and a rifle shot—that's it's too much for a deer. But you know, the, the problem is, I need—I want to get better at hunting them, but it's going to take me so many resources, you know, to get better. Um, and I don't have any way to clean myself either, so I should head right for back home. Especially considering I'm running out of hit points now. I have no stamina. Uh, yeah, this is not good. Um, got a wolf in front of us. Let's grab this really quick. Shouldn't I be washing? Shouldn't I be washed off in the rain? Like the rain can make me cold, but it doesn't wash off the blood. How does, how does that work? I'm not sure if I got to finish my thought or not, because I usually go from one sentence to the other without finishing my thought. All right, so here's the deal. I can't get better with the bow without spending resources by missing with the bow that I don't really want to spend. <laughs> kind of sucks, but. What are you going to do? I mean, we eventually got him. It's fine. All right, let's go ahead and throw that in there. And let's make ourselves some cordage. And some more planks. And I really don't want that to go bad, so I'm just going to kind of... Eh, it's going to take a while. I'm not going to worry about it. What's, it's not going to go bad. Come on. Come on, this is KG48. I'm not going to let anything go bad. All right, so I'm going to need ash and... Of these, some of that, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. Okay. Still looking good. Let's go ahead and put this stuff away. Uh, see, we've got we've got plenty of nails. We still need another 15 cordage. And our wood is looking pretty good. So that is that yeah, it's just the, the cordage, man. It's it's killing me. It really is. You need a lot of it for a lot of different things. Um, I should also go check my fish traps, but I'm gonna wait for this to be done first. You know, it's funny, on the way back, I saw a moose. Like, I would have rather gotten the moose than even tried the deer. I might never try a deer again. Like, I don't see what the point is. Just go after a moose. Um, save. Damn it, we lost, uh... We lost food. Ah, son of a bis biscuits. Son of a biscuits. 
All right, well, turn. Come on, man. <laughs> I wasn't going up. It's a little tricky in the water sometimes. Like for some reason, I just don't seem to go up. You know, very easily. Um, I can usually get up there, but I don't go up as fast as you know I feel like I should. All right, so let's go ahead and cook these. Ugh, that freaking meat. That that meat going bad sucks. Although I will need it for other things like insect repellent, um, strength boosts, stuff like that. But still, I prefer not to burn it, obviously. Or not burn it. I, I don't want to burn it either, but I prefer not to let it go bad. So before I forget, let's check on the rogue hunters in the area. Okay. And... Well, that all looks about normal. You guys see anything I don't? Uh, I'm not seeing any campfires except for these two. But I could just be missing them. That nah, looks pretty good. Oh, there's one right there. Okay, that's fine there. I don't usually go that far. So I just got to make sure not to go that far tomorrow. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. All right, so I've decided I am going to make myself two ladder hatches. Okay. Um, and yeah, I should, have every I should have everything I need for that. Let's go ahead and we still need a little bit more of this. Some more copper. What's new, right? And then we got... There we go. So we got three. That'll be four. And that should be everything we need for it. For the two ladder hatches. Uh, let's go ahead and put some more stuff in there. Um, I do want to pick my crops as well. But you guys won't be able to... Well, I do have this. All right, yeah, let's go up and pick our crops. This thing really doesn't help that much, to be perfectly honest. But um, it helps enough. All right. So let's go ahead and take all of the seeds. I'm not going to be doing any medical stuff. I'm not going to be doing any onion seeds. So, yeah, that looks good. Let's come on up here. Can you guys see alright with this thing? Yeah, it looks okay, I guess. And let's go ahead and pick all the crops. Give me all my carrots. Give me all my cotton. Alright, we are cold, but we should be alright. Come on. There go. Alright. So... Six. Should we could just make another five? We only have one thing to plant that's not this. So yeah, let's just go ahead and extract the other five seeds. Okay, and then uh, one, two, three. There, and then we'll do another one, two, three, and four. Okay, they both got that. I'm gonna put. I'm gonna give them a little fertilizer. All right. I think our um, our fruits and vegetables is pretty much well taken care of at this point. Yeah, for sure. It's right there. And then we're going to grab the these guys. And then we're going to come over here and we're going to grab... What else do I need for this? Um, yeah, plenty of that. Okay, so just wood and metal. And we just need two of these. This is my first time ever using ladder hatches. I'm pretty freaking excited. So another cool thing is... Um, I, I mean, let's let's take a look really quick. Look at all this carbo fruits and vegetables we have now. I call them carbohydrates, fruits and vegetables, same freaking thing. It's not like, it's not like, oh my god, I never have to worry about it again. But it's really starting to get, you know, to a, a comfortable area. Um, I think another, I think once we get, uh, our nails are pretty good. Once we get the wood to about forty or fifty planks, and we get these to about forty or fifty, I think we could do another building episode. That's kind of what I'm looking at at this point. All right, so those are looking good. I will want to build in the morning now. So let me go ahead and uh, finish up the night, and we'll do some uh, building in the morning. Okay, let's go out and put these things down, see how they work. Uh, like I said, I'm gonna—they're eventually gonna be put down here, but I'm gonna leave these here just for, um, just for ease of use. You know, uh, actually, maybe I should put them right next to them. Uh, nah, it's fine. It's fine. I'll just put them right here. Okay. So, how does this work? All right, I guess I just um, plop it right in there. All right, cool. And you know what? Uh, we're going to need a couple foundations here, aren't we? All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a couple of roof pieces, and then I'm going to replace foundations. We'll do, we will do a little bit of building today. I prefer to do a whole building episode, but um, there's nothing we can do about it. we got to do a little bit of building here, which should be fine. Make a couple of roof pieces. That'll be okay. So this needs to get up to 40. This needs to get up to 40. And this needs to get up to 100 before I do a major building episode. I should be able to do that. It shouldn't be too difficult. 
Okay. So while that's doing its thing, we will be grabbing stuff. So let's grab this right here. This is a foundation, I believe. So we're going to pick this up. And we're going to bring it over here. Okay, all the way down here. And come on, lock in. So lock, oh, there we go. Lock in like that. Okay. Okay, so one more foundation will be good. Perfect. Uh, so that's not a regular foundation. Where's a regular foundation? Uh, that one right there is a regular foundation. Okay, fair enough. We're going to pick this one up next. I think, I think you guys can see what I'm doing here, right? Like, this right here is probably going to be the... Oh, that's not a foundation. Okay. Is this a foundation? Anyway, this is going to be, like, pretty much the top floor of the base, I think. I don't I don't see me needing another floor above this. Although, maybe... I, who knows? But as of right now, I don't see another floor above that. Above the floor above me. I think that's going to be the top. I don't think I'm going to use roof pieces either. Like, ever. I don't love them. But we'll see. Okay, there you go, and then we take this, and this should go right in right here, right? Do I need walls? You know what, I might need walls. Yeah, I guess that makes sense that I would need walls. Okay, well, why don't we go ahead and make ourselves a wall? Well, we're going to need the materials for that. Ain't no freebies in this world, people. All right, I think I'm actually going to, um, here, let's do this. Let's put this down. Replace these. And replace this. I love having that, um, that auto miner. It's just so nice to know that work is getting done while I'm doing other things, you know? It's like, um, it's just really good feeling. All right, let's go ahead and make a regular wall. And to be honest... I think I'm going to want that wall to be up here. Because I've got too many window windows up here. Way too many windows. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab this. We'll put the wall up here. And I'm going to bring this down here. Because a window down there won't be as bad as a window up here. Okay. And one window should do it, right? Maybe two. All right. And we put that up there. Number six. Is that it? Is that how I do it? Um, oh, that's weird that there's a hatch down here. That's odd. Oh! Oh, nice! Wait, how do you climb up it, though? Close. Wait, how do you... <laughs> that's really cool the way that works, but I'm not sure how to climb up it. All I see is close. Hmm, what am I missing? Oh, you just climb up it. Okay, so you don't have to actually press a button. Alright, wow, this is... I like this, man. This is cool. Oh, that's even... That's even cooler than I thought it was going to be. Oh, man. Oh, that's gnarly. I love it. So I've got another question here. Why don't we test this out to see if we can bring stuff up and down the ladder in ghost form? Okay. Yeah. All right, so we brought this down. So that, that can definitely go down. Let's see if we can bring stuff up. Because if we can bring stuff up, I could I could tear down this whole stuff right in front of me and um, use it for a next building episode. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. Okay. All right, I see what we're going to do next episode. Wow, that is unbelievably cool. I, I, I'm i kind of surprised. I didn't expect it to be that cool. And um, that's always a good thing when, it, when, when the game, you know... Uh, it goes above your expectations, you know? That's always awesome. Let's kind of look up here. Come on, get on there. There we go. Yeah, that's freaking awesome. I love that. So, um, the next thing we need to do in our building episode is get all the foundations that are up there, down here, basically. Um, did I make found? Oh, I made foundations out of these? That was stupid. Why the hell did I do that? These These curved walls should not have been foundations. What the hell was I thinking? Oh, that's really weird. I mean, it might not matter because I might just bring them down here anyway. But yeah, that was a that was a bit of a mistake. We need to get all the uh, foundations down there, and then the roof pieces up here to replace the foundations. Although I think I would like to replace, I think I'd like to finish the roof pieces up here before I do anything else. Um, now that this is working and I can pull all this stuff out of here, 
I, I'm going to try really hard to do a building episode next episode. Although I did go through a lot of my resources today. But like I said, if I can get like 125 nails, 40 wood, 40 cordage, um, I should be within striking distance of doing the building video I want to do to get the ceiling. Um, I, I don't like building like a little bit at a time. I like, you know, doing whole building episodes. So um, we'll see though. I never know what I'm going to do. I kind of just go with the flow and um, make the best videos I possibly can. All right, guys. I do think I'm going to call this one here. By the way, those hatch ladder things are like 10 times cooler than I thought they were going to be. Like, I can't believe how much cooler they are than, than I thought they were going to be. So I want you guys to throw a like in here. If, you know, give me a like on how awesome those things are. It's a cage. Those things are so awesome. I simply have to like this video. Show the love for the hatch ladders or ladder hatches. If I, Ladder hatches. Yeah, show some love for the ladder hatches. Things are just awesome. All right, guys. Anyway, if you didn't enjoy the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.